Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and I'm going to show you how you can configure Jenkins for your first time use. Alright, so in the previous video we have installed Jenkins successfully and we saw this screen at our local host. So I, I am running Jenkins currently on localhost 8000 but it usually runs on the port 8080. Alright, so I'll show you how you can configure Jenkins. So first of all you need to enter the administrator password here if you want to log in into Jenkins. So for so currently I'm running Jenkins using Docker right here. So for this, so for getting the password here, I need to execute a command inside the container. For that, the syntax goes something like Docker exec hyphen it and the name of the container, which is Jenkins container for me. And then I can simply copy the variable inside the directory which is something like slash where slash jenkins secrets and slash initial admin password all right so this is the exact directory present right here we need to get the variable from this all right so if i execute this command i should get the contents of this file so i've got the password right here this is the actual password which we are going to use to log in inside jenkins all right so if you are using jenkins on your uh, local device by uh, using the installer and installing the jenkins from that then you need to access another file uh, inside your system which will be present on uh, the directory which will be written right here so basically you have to get the contents of this directory and you'll get your password so uh, i've got the password here and now, now i'll log in inside my jenkins server all right so we have installed uh, we have logged inside our jenkins server and it says resume installation so before this i i got a screen which stated install suggested plugins or customize install is installation so i had installed the suggested plugins so it has started installing the default plugins for me just like the screen so i installed suggested plugins just for the time being and it starts installing the suggested suggested plugins right here perfect so after we have installed the suggested plugins then you'll see something like this which is create first admin user so now you can create a user right here so i'll just create a user name with something like admin and then i can uh, choose some kind of password and i can confirm that password i can write in my full name and then i can also write some email address all right so i'll just save and continue this all right so i have created a user here and now it asks me for the jenkins url this is a url where the jenkins server will be actually running so for me it is currently running on local host but if you uh, wish to deploy your jenkins server on some ec2 instance or a google cloud uh, virtual cloud server then you can enter the public ip address of that server and the 8880 port for that so for this i'll just keep it as localhost 8080 and then i'll click on save and finish and that's it so jenkins is ready and the setup is complete so now you can actually start using jenkins and you can uh, see the dashboard right here so now you can create the job you can set up agents and configure cloud and everything you wish to do with jenkins right here is present so that's how you set up jenkins for the first time use and that's it for the video so thanks for watching